Hey, what's going on everybody? It's April 8th, 2021 up in Big Bear Lake, California, and we are just doing uh, an update, and this is probably going to be the last update until we get more snow, or uh, basically when I'm staying at other Airbnbs or hotels and stuff, we'll obviously do videos there, but in the meantime, yeah, check out, I got the card detailed, you guys, you're not going to believe it, you're not going to believe it, like, I mean, it's ridiculous. He did such an incredible job. And then I found out from him that he doesn't detail, they don't do detailing. He did it for me because I'm I'm his friend. That's really cool. They own the car washing place, but they do like regular washes. They just don't do full, full details. But like he gets into it and like, oh, it's just, the guy did an incredible job. You guys remember how this thing looked, right? I mean, all the stains are out of the seats. This is just crazy. I mean, I can't believe this. This guy did such an amazing job. But yeah, anyway, we are gonna go run to the village real quick. Oh yeah. Hope everyone's doing well. Kind of sad we're exiting the snow season, but it is what it is. We will be coming up here on our monsoonal se monsoon season. So we'll be getting some more weather. And the monsoon season's cool, you guys. Uh, for those of you who love the snow like I do, I'm, you know, even though it's completely different, the thunderstorms, I'm sure those are enjoyable for you guys as well, right? I hope so, because I'm so OCD about this channel, I'll do them anyway. <laughs> um, so I just hope that you guys dig it. It's gonna be nice. I can't believe how clear my windshield is. Oh my gosh. I mean, this is crazy guys you guys remember like just go back to any video and just look at how filthy my freaking car was just any video in, in, in here just down here anything just insane i mean they did such a good job oh my. he does it by himself too the detailing part he owns uh fox farm auto spa or uh oh man they sell really fine wines too. So, so, so that's one big thing he's trying to do is sell really fine, uh, like uh, have stuff like that there. And it's hard to market because he's a car wash, <laughs> right? But um, for those of you like from my area, Newport Beach and stuff like that, who uh, who might you know indulge a little bit more on uh, the, the fiscal side of wine. Uh, he's got some amazing stuff. If those of you from Orange County know High Times Liquor Store off of Ogle, I used to live off of Ogle Street in Costa Mesa for a while. It's like on, on the border of Newport and Costa Mesa, basically. High Times Liquor Store, one of the best liquor stores anywhere. Uh, they have amazing wines and huge wine cellars. And for those of you who know that place, this is kind of like what he has. It's very scaled down, of course, but the quality is there. It's fantastic stuff. But yeah, dude, look at this car. Look at the seat back. I mean, everything's just like shiny and shiny happy people call me. Okay, hang on a sec. Well, I was on my Harley all morning until my car was done. I dropped my car off yesterday about 11 a.m. and it was just, just finished right now. But yeah, he was saying he like, he'll like sit in the, in, in one of the uh, carports and uh you know after hours and listen to music and sip on some wine and stuff like that and uh just detail the hell out of it and i'm telling you guys like there is not one nook and cranny in this damn car that has not been clean when you open the door you know when you open your door all the way and then you push it that little extra bit it'll go like another like two inches well like he pushes it and like holds it open that extra two inches to like get where you'll never see ever 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 um and i don't and i don't know why i keep on like expressing how good he is because no one's ever going to be able to get your car detailed from him um <laughs> because he doesn't detail car that's like as i said he they own fox farm auto wash or car spa but they just don't don't do these types of fully intricate details and for for me, I got the local discount and it was 325 bucks and I gave him a $50 tip. I hope that's a good tip for this. Because man, I am so happy about this. Next time it snows, I'm, I might just take my Harley because I don't want to get this thing dirty. <laughs> but anyway, we're in the village, guys. It is 64 degrees. Let me turn up, I'll turn this up a little bit. 64 degrees up in this mug. 
and we have 90 miles till empty. I know you guys are really needing to know that. But anyway, instead of turning right here, we're just gonna go straight a little bit, go up Cameron, and then we'll hit Snow Summit on the way back so you guys can see what's going on over there. I'm pretty sure it's closed now, but uh, I'm not 100% sure. I'm probably wrong. I've been wrong before. It's happened. So, so you guys can see it's never been this clean before and then when you go on the inside look at that i mean seriously you guys remember how bad this was everything right here the dash i mean look at this he did an incredible job oh, man. look at that i mean everything guys just insane I know I use the word insane a lot, and it has nothing to do with anything I talk about. Yeah, very beautiful. I can't believe I got it detailed. All right, anyway, we're back in the village. Look at this, this is so cool. We got a bunch of people out. This is great to see. Look at the little doggy. What's up, little doggy? Hey, little doggy. Oh, that's how I feel around the big dogs, too. It's like, oh, oh, inferior. <laughs> We're gonna come over here and eat some Crave Lobster today after we run over some kids here. Yep, running over kids is part of the day. You gotta do it to come up to Big Bear and have a good time. Yes, yes you do. Just kidding, just kidding. We run over adults as well. Not just, we don't discriminate. We will run over them all. All right. So yeah, we're gonna go by Snow Summit real quick. Uh, it's gonna be, I don't know what it's gonna be like. I'm looking forward to seeing it actually. So, okay, what is going on here? It is so nice what they did to my car. I'm so excited about it. And then my Harley gets picked up in like a week and a half. They come with, with some truck and then this big arm comes out and picks the Harley up and brings it into the truck and they're gonna replace my tires even though I've only had them for 3,000 miles, I told them to put on brand new ones. But like the best ones, I told them, I don't care how, how many miles less I, I get for like a better tire. Safety is the number one concern on that thing. So I'll, I'll, I'll do whatever, like if I have to get a loan to get the best safety equipment, I will. So uh, we're gonna do the, the new, new brakes on the front and back, new tires and it's tune up and stuff like that. And this thing is just going to be beast mode. I'm so excited about it. But yeah, so I, you know, these are things I look forward to. I know they aren't really a big thing for, for most people, but I look forward to them. It makes me happy. Does it make you happy? Yeah, guys, look, there's like no snow in there, zero. Zippity doo dah, zippity a. My oh my, there's no snowy day. Wish we had some snow coming, but I gotta tell you, it's been really nice riding riding the motorcycle. And I'll be doing a couple videos on the motorcycle around the national forest. We'll cruise around the forest, not like off roading, because that my Harley doesn't work really well off road. But uh, we will be getting an enduro sometime. I'm gonna save up. I'm gonna put like a hundred bucks a month away, starting soon, and then in like. I don't know, two years or something. I know that's a long time away, but I gotta be smart. And that would be ultra fun. And I know it would be cool for the channel. I know you guys would dig it because we'll be like, like in the mountain. It's, it's just super cool. In the, you, you know what I mean? Not physically inside the mountain, but. Anyway, we're gonna turn right here. This is called Thrush Street. It's where Carl's Jr. is, and we're turning on here to go in the back way to Snow Summit. I hope we don't have any problems. So it says no ski resort access. Straight ahead. So when you go up here, if they like stop you and say, can't you read the sign? You're like, yeah, it says no ski resort access, but I'm a snowboarder. <laughs> Sorry. Sorry, I didn't mean that. Not mean that. Huh? No, 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 no,
these houses though. Imagine waking up and knowing that like a few hundred yards to your left is a ski resort. Look at these places, man. Oh, I'm I'm entering where I shouldn't. I'm in big trouble. Guys, we're in big trouble here. I don't know why I'm so crazy like this, but we're doing the craziest move ever. Oh, look what we did. Looky, looky here, looky here. Looky here. This is beautiful. Man, I'd like to live in one of these places too, though, because it's right on the resort. You know what? I kind of did choke because we're not going to be able to drive back. Oh, wait, yes, we are. If it makes you happy. And a man with a man now, wow, wow, wow. If it makes you happy. You guys, can you believe how long we've been doing this channel? I can't believe it. Like, it's like crazy because like, it, it's not like we have huge, huge, huge parties and like, I like meet all of you. So like, it's like, like knowing that there's so many people, well, at least in my eyes, there's so many people watching. It's just so cool, man. It, you know, and the fact that I might, might be able to help a little bit in terms of your guys' stay. Look at that. It's, nice back of a car but there's no summit there's obviously skiing going on guys look up oh, that person's getting naked we should probably i don't want to get demonetized here <laughs> especially a kid getting naked jeez louise what are you doing i'm just kidding got his shorts on all right so yeah we're flying through here flying through and look at the oh man look at there's some dark spots i would roll down the window but we just got it detailed and i'm and I'm about to run over the people. I like running over the people. I'm just kidding. Just kidding. Just kidding. I shouldn't even joke like that. There's actually been a couple hit and runs up here. And uh, it's very, very sad stuff. Oh, sorry. sorry about that. There's snow summit right there. So I hope you guys can see it. I don't think that guy's too stoked on me filming him. So we're going to have to not film him. Because if it makes him happy. Okay, we're on Summit Boulevard. Look in the rear view. We can actually see in the rear view with this car being clean. It doesn't look too good, but oh, come on. There we go. Oh, boom. Boom, boom, boom. Isn't that sad, guys? We're leaving the mountain. It's a sad state of affairs. Yeah. It's seriously like when I was younger, talking like teens and 20s and even 30s, I'm not much older than 30s, but like uh, all my homeboys were always up here snowboarding, always up here. And when the season would end, it would be like depression would set in, I'm telling you guys. So I know how a lot of you feel. And uh, I just wish I was rich enough to build my own mountain, just, just out of love and blow snow on it all day long, all year round for you guys. I'll let you guys ski all year round. They do it in Dubai. There's a, whatchamacallit in Dubai, uh, indoor ski resort, can you guys believe that? In like 100 degree weather, it was an indoor ski resort. And the thing is humongous, you should check it out. You should check it out. Oh my gosh, I'm not gonna make the line, oh my gosh. So, uh, yeah, yeah, I really miss you guys. Guess what, I'm, uh, for my other channel, I'm, I'm going back to Florida. It's gonna be the same airports again. I was, uh, no, I'm go, I'm, when we land, we're fl I flew into a different airport, like two hours away, just so when I film the flight and stuff, it'll be a different journey. <laughs> it's the same place, oh my gosh. So we're flying first class again to go see my dad in a couple weeks, three weeks from today. Um, and I got a nice rental car again and we're flying into Tala I'm flying into Tallahassee and he lives in Freeport so the airport I should be flying into is VPS um, Fort Walton Beach but I'm flying into Tallahassee and uh, yeah as I said first class so it's gonna be easier to film again I'm not gonna get as nervous about annoying people because obviously I'm it, it, if, if I didn't have a window seat, I'm not gonna like hold my camera up facing the window the whole time, you know, but uh, you know what I'm saying. Uh, first class makes it easier. And uh, yeah, you only live once.
Lulu wants him. When you guys check out the price differences in first class, it's ridiculously small. Like, ridiculously small. Some of the flights have, like, the option to, like, like, basically flip a coin. <laughs> like, pay an extra 20 bucks and hopefully get it or something. I don't know. I don't remember exactly what the offer was, but... Anyway, we're just going to finish this drive off, just going up to the North Shore a little bit. So you guys can see what it's like over here at the grocery stores. And, oh, look at that bike. Hey, hey, cool guy. Right on, man. Um, not as cool as me, but pretty damn close. Pretty damn close. It sucks because when I got my bike, it was 2019, and I got a 2020 Harley Davidson. So, like, I was the king of the hill. Now it's 2021, and I have a 2020. It's so sad. It's so sad. Even sadder is still probably the newest one up here. Like, uh, big bear, baby. Big bear. Where money comes to die. Um, let's see here. Um, yeah. <laughs> Nicest. It's such a fun Harley, you guys. And I've, I've done all the engine upgrades. But what I was trying to say before is... Um, I'm going to be going to Florida and for my other YouTube channel, the luxury hotel and resort travel. That's what the channel is called. I will be recording that flight again, or the flights from Ontario to Dallas and then from Dallas to Tallahassee. I hold my hand up at the damn window the whole time, but it, it, it comes out really, really, really pretty. It's 4k. Um, I enjoyed actually like falling asleep to the videos cause that airplane noise put me right out. So I've been watching them every, well, I, I don't watch them to be honest, like after the first time, but like, uh, well, actually I watched the takeoffs and landings cause they're in 4k and it looks so awesome. And there's like six or eight takeoff and landings on the last videos. So it's super cool. Um, and then, uh, yeah, I, I just, uh, I just enjoy doing it. And for sleep guys, I'm telling you, try it, pop it on and just, just like, Turn off the TV, but keep the sound on if you have that ability, and you'll be golden. You'll fall right asleep. That airplane noise for me, at least for me, I'm speaking subjectively, obviously, puts me right out. Anyways, guys, we've got a, here's, there's a sign right here. I'm sure you guys can read what it says. It says, boat launch, bike path, discovery center, and campground. Look at everybody's going left to the fun skin. Why is everybody going left to the fun skin? Everybody's going left. And we're going right. Ah, 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 yes, yes, yes. Look at that view, guys. Look at that view. Imagine living up here. That's what I used to think all the time. I never thought it would happen. I never thought I'd have the ability to. I thought it was going to be ridiculously expensive, you guys, because it's a resort town that people from L.A., Orange County, San, San Bernardino County, San Diego County, Riverside County, they all come to. I always forget the, the more inland places, like Victorville area stuff. This is where they all come to, Las Vegas. So, yeah, it's, uh, it's, a, it's, it's, a, it's, it's, it's a great place. I'm very, very fortunate to live here. And the most amazing thing, though, is, as I said, I thought it was going to be just priced way out of my league and it's like entry-level pricing you guys like I pay 550 a month for my rent I mean come on I mean come come on I mean I mean come on <laughs> Jimmy 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 I mean come on so yeah that's my Jimmy impression from South Park <laughs> oh man here we go again. I love it here. Look at that view right there, though. Isn't that just beautiful right there? Look at that. Just trees going up to the mountain. It's just so beautiful. Oh, my gosh. It's gorgeous. I'm so happy. Yes, it makes me. Okay, shut up already. Before I punch you right in the... Punch yourself right in the face, bro. All right, hang tight, guys, for a quick second. All right, so that was it. I forgot to, to finish the rest over there, but... uh. Yeah, that's what we got going on. It's, uh, I think I said the 8th, right? April 8th, 2021. I love you guys a lot. I'm sorry there's not much snow left, but uh, I just, uh, I miss you guys. Take care. Bye.